the whole slogan from, from the new um, administration in, in Washington, Obama's talking about repowering America. And I mean, that's sort of the right slogan, the right focus in terms of thinking about solar panels, thinking about um, how it is that you build an en energy infrastructure that isn't dependent on, on shipping petroleum from the far corners of, of, of the world, um, and, but is also very explicitly upgrading the infrastructure right here um, at the same time. So those kinds of, of, of connections are being made. Um, hopefully they will be made a whole lot quicker in the, in the coming years. What are the multilateral approaches? What institutions are working on this, or at least acknowledging and attempting to address it? Well, the big one, of course, is the, uh, is, is the post-Kyoto negotiations that are starting up at the moment. Big meeting coming in Copenhagen at the end of 2009. Um, and that is talking about emissions of, of, of carbon dioxide, um, specifically trying to reduce greenhouse gases. Um, what I don't think we're yet thinking about, um, and I think we really do need to get our heads around it, is what in the bad old days you mentioned the 70s. Um, I mean, one of the things that in the last generation we haven't been able to do is industrial planning because this was supposed to be socialist and markets were supposed to solve all our problems. Well, it's very clear in the last year or two that markets are not solving all our problems and decisions as to what to produce um, in the circumstances that we're facing can't be left entirely to markets. Um, we need to set a series of market incentives in place that make sure that we do build solar panels um, and windmills and perhaps we should build a whole lot less SUVs. Um, some of those kinds of decisions can again go if you're going to bail out the big uh, three auto companies, um, well make sure that they're building cars that are, um, are, are, are environmentally friendly, um, but why not take a few of those auto production plants over and start a crash production system on, on, on windmills um, and solar panels and, and, and structure the regulatory incentives so that uh, the utilities are, are um, encouraged to move in those kinds of directions. The Germans have been doing this. They've been figuring out that building a solar um, industry is, is, is mm -hmm. the smart, intelligent thing to do for the, for, yeah. for, the, for the future. They're taking the lead on wind. Um, they picked up the, 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 the running from the Danes there. Mm -hmm. um, and again, this is an industrial strategy. It's an intelligent thought about literally what we are making. I like to say that peace building is literally about building now. It is about building buildings that don't need large quantities of energy, um, both if we get major disruptions of the climate, but also so that they're not dependent on um, supplies coming from the other side of the planet, oil and petroleum or coal or whatever. Um, it means that in a disaster, those buildings are not dependent on energy. They're resilient in the sense that they can um, withstand um, whatever the weather throws at them.